best Jamaican high schools. It's August the 24th and it's the back to school season. It's that time when you think about sending your child back out to school. So have you ever wondered what is the best high school in Jamaica? The rankings are based on the performance of schools in obtaining five or more subjects in the most recent CSEC examinations. The figures are calculated based on each secondary school enabling their cohort at the end of their five years of statutory education to leave grade 11 with a minimum of five subjects, which includes English and mathematics in the CSEC examinations. Sure, CXC assigns grades based on profile performance at CSEC and module performance at CAPE. Each subject has grade descriptors that are used to determine the minimum acceptable score at each profile or each module. For instance, for CSET Economics, a grade A candidate is expected to demonstrate outstanding ability to apply economic concepts and principles, while a grade B candidate just demonstrates a good ability to apply economic concepts and principles. So there you have it, and here they are, sorted by the very best. These are the top 10 high schools in Jamaica. Welcome back to Elite Jamaica, the place you come to learn about Jamaica and Jamaicans. If it's your first time joining me here, consider subscribing to the channel by clicking that red subscribe button. And remember to turn on notifications by clicking that bell icon so you never miss any of my updates. Number 10. Mannings High School 95.8% Did you know that the old Mannings High School building is the second oldest of its type in Jamaica? Yes, it is. But the singularity of Mannings School is much greater than the historic old building. Now, the library. It has a deep and interesting history and a very strong and proud heritage. Number 9. Ulmer's Boys School Ulmer's Boys School is the oldest high school in the Caribbean, being established in 1729 by John Ulmer. The Ulmer schools are considered among the Caribbean's most prestigious schools, and the most prestigious in Jamaica, with traditional British-style uniform and a strong Christian ethos. The schools more closely resemble British schools of the 1980s than of today, a trend that can be noted, noted of the entire Jamaican schooling system. Number 8. Ulmer's High School for Girls Ulmer's Trust High School for Girls, acknowledged as separate institutions, each school carries the same crest and motto, which is in Latin so I will place it on the screen, and it's a phrase which translates to whatever you do, do it to the best of your abilities. Number 7. St. Hilda's High School for Girls St. Hilda's High School for Girls is owned by the Anglican Diocese. The school is deeply committed to producing students with quality education. Therefore, it seeks to always promote and encourage high academic achievements. Training is geared to the fostering and engendering of social adjustment in all areas of life. Students are educated to take responsibility for their individual development. By doing so, they will cultivate and display cultural, environmental, and moral awareness. Ultimately, it is hoped that our students will emerge as leaders able to articulate desirable societal, societal values and attitudes. Number 6. St. Andrew High School for Girls St. Andrew High School has been at the forefront of secondary education and has a heralded history of excellence now documented at the Emory James Museum. Founded in 1925 through a partnership between the Presbyterian Church and the Wesleyan Snod of Jamaica, St. Andrew High School today is one of the best opportunities for secondary education in Jamaica. St. Andrew graduates have blazed trails, recorded distinguished career achievements, and holding ever true to the school motto, Life More Abundant, have made significant contributions to Jamaica and the world. Number 5. The Hampton School for Girls Hampton School is an all-girls boarding school located in Malvern, Jamaica. It is one of the oldest boarding schools in Jamaica and was founded in 1858, two years after its all-boys counterpart, Monroe College. The school was originally named Fort Rose and was constructed from funds received from the Monroe and Dickinson Trust. The school motto is in Latin, so it will be placed on your screen. It means with utmost courage and courtesy. Number 4. 
Westwood High School. The Westwood High School is an all-female high school located in Stuart Town, Trelawney, Jamaica. It was founded in 1882 by Baptist minister Rev. W. M. Webb with the aim to provide unsegregated education for girls. I still don't understand the point right here. The school also set up a board of trustees to represent the different Protestant denominations. It caters to secondary students and after 36 years reopened its sixth form program in 2014. Westwood is among the five boarding schools remaining in Jamaica and has been the only school to retain the tradition of wearing a Jippy Japa hat. Seriously, that's what it's called. Number 3. Montego Bay High School Montego Bay High School is not only one of the two all-girls secondary schools in Montego Bay. It is the high school of Montego Bay and the St. James in general boasting some of the best CXC and CSEC exam results both in St. James and Jamaica. As a top for performing high school, it is also awarded some of the brightest young minds from the primary schools on a yearly basis. There are a number of notable and outstanding Jamaicans who pass through this noble institution. This includes Jamaican's chief, Jamaica's Chief Justice, Zayla Makala. The school was established in 1935 by the government of Jamaica to fill the need of an all-girls high school in St. James. It was the first government-owned high school for girls established on the island. It was established with the aim of developing in its students mental alertness, physical health, spiritual consciousness, and a sense of responsibility. Today, they do not only excel academically, but also seek to enhance the talents of their students through participation in the arts, including the JCDC Music and Speech Fest festivals. They are also heavily involved in the 4-H club and debating club competitions. Number 2. Immaculate High School for Girls Immaculate High School for Girls is an environment where goodness and honesty are exemplified and promoted, where excellence is encouraged and the potential of each individual is patiently nurtured, ensuring an enriching educational experience which in turn generates competent, virtuous and happy citizens. Number 1. Campion College Campion College has ranked as top school in Jamaica based on the CSEC and CAPE examinations more times than any other school. The school is named after St. Edmund Campion, a brilliant and celebrated Oxford scholar, priest and Jesuit martyr. He was an intrepid defender of the spiritual authority of the Holy See, who died most honorably on the gallows at Tyburn on December 1, 1581. His execution and torture were the cause of numerous conversions to the Catholic faith. After being cruelly racked, it was proposed to him to hold a disputation with some of the famous Protestant divines, being allowed only to answer the objections and not to attack his adversaries. Although in a dying state, he triumphed with such success that they hastened and his death. The expense is reckoned. The enterprise has begun. It is of God. It cannot be withstood. Those were the words of Edmund Campion. Thank you for joining me again guys. I really do hope you found this video interesting. If so, please remember to subscribe to Elite Jamaica and turn on notifications by clicking that bell icon so you never miss any of my updates.